Hey y'all, it's Jennifer. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a Walmart grocery pickup haul. So stick around. I'm going to share with you what my meal plan is for this week and what I picked up. Real quick, if you have not done so already, please subscribe to my channel below and also go ahead and hit the notification bell so you will get notified each time that I upload a video. I upload grocery hauls weekly and sometimes there's some Dollar Tree hauls up in there so you never know what you might get coming your way. So today I spent 100, around $102. Um, that will last us for this week. I'm going to go ahead and show you, with you guys now what our meal plan is for this week. So hold tight. All right, and also, as always, make sure you check the description box for this information as well as a $10 coupon for your first Walmart grocery pickup order. I would definitely highly recommend it. So here's our meal plan for this week. Today is Saturday. We are gonna be eating chicken enchiladas. Um, I have a lovely recipe that my husband requests over and over again, so that's how I know that it is good. <laughs> Tomorrow we are gonna have um, sausage sandwiches with potato chips. Monday is going to be breakfast, probably bacon, which is Hayden and Harrison's favorite. Daddy will be at work. Tuesday, meatloaf, mashed potatoes, and green beans. Daddy will be at work again, so therefore I can have meatloaf because Jeff does not like meatloaf. Hayden, however, loves it, and I do too. So, we're taking advantage. Sorry, Daddy. <laughs> Wednesday, um, the recipe that I tried a couple of weeks ago that I got off of Pinterest was the sausage and rice. Um, it was delicious. It was really good. Um, Jeff took it the next night for his... Um, evening meal and he liked it as well. Thursday, chicken nuggets and tater tots we have left over from this past week. We only eat about half of the bag. Um, so we will be um, eating out of our freezer that night. And then Friday, we're gonna have pizza. So there is our grocery, or excuse me, our, there is our meal plan. All right, we're gonna take a look at our groceries now. All right, so this week, <laughs> I actually asked for the wheat with honey bread instead of the sandwich white sandwich bread and they substituted the white sandwich bread instead that's okay I guess they know that I like that one as well so we will take it got a party size of the Doritos that is supposed to be the spicy and it is the regular nacho cheese oh well it's okay we'll eat them um I don't know if that was an error on my part or theirs <laughs> this is starting out kind of crazy huh all right so for our sausage sandwiches for tomorrow night, I went ahead and got these um, sub rolls here. Um, I wanted to try something different besides like the regular Pepperidge Farm thing that, you know, usually get off of the um, bread aisle. So got a 20 count of flour tortillas here. This is going to be for the chicken enchiladas tonight. Um, they had marked in my order that these were unavailable. But guess what? When I went into the store, they were piled full. So I'm not really sure if the person that was picking my order just didn't know where to find these or what, but I'm gonna let them know on my survey because things like this have been happening a little more. And I mean, I'm still thankful for the service and I will still use it, but you know, I still have to run into the store and grab a couple things that were not um, available apparently. Got my celery sticks here. I like buying them this way because they are already cut. You don't get the little tiny pieces. They're all pretty much all the same size. Um, there is a recipe that I'm going to be making um, this week. The sausage and rice. It calls for pepper and onion, but I used celery and onion in it and it turned out really, really good. So I'm going to be using the celery um, for that because I also wanted celery for my celery and peanut butter that I like to um, have. All right, and the next thing that I got, I don't know why these are over here, but <laughs> I got six bananas. We always keep bananas on um, stock here because Harrison loves them. Hayden loves them. Like them in smoothies, this and that. Got one green bell pepper and a thing of onions. This is going to be for our sausage sandwiches tomorrow night. Obviously not all of these onions, but when anytime I need onions, I just get a big bag of them. Um, I'm going to put these in the pan and fry them from our sausage sandwiches tomorrow night, even though I'm the only one that eats the peppers and onions. <laughs> I don't care. If you have a sausage sandwich, I want peppers and onions. I don't know. It's just something about it. 
got a bag of roasted potatoes. It's a five pound bag. This is gonna, um, I'm probably gonna make like baked potatoes and stuff this week just for like lunch and things like that. But I also needed a couple to make um, mashed potatoes on um, Tuesday night for um, Hayden and I. Um, got a pack of blueberries here. Y'all know who that's for. <laughs> No, we all eat them, and then they go in smoothies and things like that, but that seems to be Harrison's favorite fruit. And then I went ahead and got one avocado. Um, I like to cut this up and put this on scrambled eggs or on toast. Um, avocado is pretty good for you. It's a good fat, apparently. I don't need no more of that, but that's all right. <laughs> got a thing of ketchup here. I usually get the Heinz, um no fructose corn syrup, but I was in a hurry and I was trying, I was right at the edge of my budget. So I just went ahead and got the, I think this was only like a dollar <laughs> and it's the great value brand, but it's okay. This time we'll let it go. Um, I got the classic ranch. Um, Harrison likes to dip his carrots in ranch and then you always need to have ranch. We were out here. Um, this is a can of diced green chilies that is going to go in the, um, chicken enchiladas tonight. And then here's our meat. Um, so we are having sausage twice this week. I like this butterball turkey sausage. So one is for um, tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow for our sausage sandwiches and one for the sausage and rice recipe that I'm doing on Wednesday. Got one pound of ground beef. Um, that's going to be for our meatloaf. And then I got a one pound thing here of the applewood smoked bacon. We've got a pack of Great Value Hard Salami, a pack of our Oscar Mayer Natural Turkey Breast. This is our go-to every week, but I kind of threw a little something in the mix here to kind of change it up a little bit. Here's all the cheese I got. We like cheese. Got a eight ounce of medium cheddar and an eight ounce of mozzarella. I've been like liking shredding cheese here lately. It just seems like it's so much better um, fresh. This is um, two cups of shredded Monterey Jack. This is going to go in the chicken enchiladas tonight. It's for that recipe. I don't think I used the whole thing, but um, if not, we'll use it somewhere else. Got four sticks of sweet cream butter here. Got Harrison some M&Ms. <laughs> Harrison is so funny. He comes over to my snack pantry and in the kitchen and he will just stand right where he knows the chocolate is and sign for more. Uh, <laughs> and, and it's like now it's like it's he not he don't really put two and two together. He's asking more specifically. I think he just thinks that that means chocolate now. <laughs> so anyway, I got him a little box of M&Ms because I like to give him a little treat every once in a while. Uh, I got a box or a pack, pack package. Goodness gracious. Y'all know I stumble over my words while talking too fast. Um, Chips Ahoy. The chewy ones. Hayden loves the chewy Chips Ahoy and not the hard cookies. He does not like hard cookies. He will not eat them. Um, so this was a request of his. Got another pack of our turkey sausage sticks here. This is a favorite snack in the house. We've got 36 eggs here. We go through some eggs around this house with breakfast, scrambled eggs, uh, what else, French toast, you name it. We love eggs. So from our heads down to our legs, you know I had to add that, sorry. <laughs> got a six count here of the strawberry applesauce. I like to throw these in Hayden's lunchbox. Um, Harrison loves the um, Easy Mac Kraft macaroni and cheese. This is only this is like one of the only things that I know for sure he will eat. We got Daddy a couple of chicken pot pies to take to work for to eat um, on his break time, and to kind of switch up the breakfast routine for Hayden, I got him some sausage biscuits. He likes to sneak over to my dad's house and get, get these. He calls them little hamburgers. He, I don't think he knows they're sausage. But um, I got those for him to try out. I got four Tostino's party pizzas here. I've got two of the triple cheese and two of the pepperoni. And I got these home and they were solid frozen, guys. So I know um, the Walmart people are taking good care of my stuff. Either that or they had just picked my order. Um, but I'm thinking they probably just pulled that out of the freezer. And I'm thankful for that. You know, I like to, I like to get home and know... My stuff's not been setting out somewhere. So, anyway, we only got one gallon of our regular milk this week and two gallons of chocolate milk. And no, I didn't get an opened 
a gallon of milk here. <laughs> I had to um, give some to a child before um, we did this haul. So, you know, that's what happens when you run out of chocolate milk. You have to open up some for your grocery, from your grocery haul. I got um, more apple juice here for the kiddos. And we've got some Diet Pepsi, the 24. This was another thing, y'all. <laughs> This was another thing they said that they were out of, and it was stocked again. As I had said, I think not last haul, but haul before, they left this out of my order and said it was out of stock. But guess what? There's three places in that store that um, they carry this on the shelf, and they were all three fully stocked. So I'm going to be emailing about that because I don't know what happened I mentioned it to the lady when I was on my way out the door um, when she was thanking me for coming in. And I was like, well, you know, it's good to see you too, but. <laughs> and she had told me that they had sent several people home the, yesterday. I don't know what that had to do with my grocery order today, but um, maybe they were shorthanded. I don't know. But I will be letting them know about that because I feel like that's the only way that they're going to improve is to know when things go wrong. I do always do my survey that they send me and I always get... Um, very wonderful service there and the friendly help. Um, so I mostly am giving good feedback. So I'm going to let them know when something does go wrong. Okay, rent over. <laughs> I got a six can, uh, six cans of the twist up. These are um, Hayden's little um, prize for being a good boy. He gets one of these usually a day probably. So Got a couple of non-food items here. I've got a pack of the Micromint Plackers. These are our favorite. We use these instead of like dental floss. Um, maybe it's wasteful, probably is wasteful, but they're convenient and I'm big on flossing. So if I can get Hayden to floss um, like I want him to, then we're gonna buy those. Got a 12 count of the dishwasher packs here and then got um, Jeff some deodorant that he requested last week and I forgot to add to the order proud wife moment <laughs> and also guess what I got I got another little baggie with goodies so I don't know if you guys went this morning and got yours but it comes with um some chocolate chip jiff power ups here creamy clusters it says that looks pretty good got some cotton nail flushable wipes got a box of a special K cereal a gain fling in the blissful breeze scent. A tahini bar. I'm not sure what that is. We'll, we'll eat it. We won't, won't turn food away here. Uh, gain flings. And a roll of toilet paper. They know I need that. And a nice little bag to use with a little pamphlet on all of the products inside and a nice little scan code for you to be able to add them to your grocery order. All right, friends, that's going to do it for my Walmart grocery pickup order today. I hope you have enjoyed my video. If you have, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button down below. And then, again, I'm going to remind you to go ahead and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this one that you've seen today. Don't forget to use my code below if you have not used the Walmart grocery pickup before. As I said, highly recommended. So, anyway, I hope everybody's having a wonderful day. And until next time, see you guys. Bye.